wake up one and a half hours before I need to get into the office so I can have plenty of time for a slow morning. Before I go to work, I like to read for 10 minutes. Recently, I'm reading Barbarians at the Gate, which is about one of the largest corporate takeover in Wall Street in the 80s. It's not only a fascinating read, but also a relevant one to my job. So I guess it's a win-win. I live really close to the office, so every morning I can just walk in, I put on the podcast, maybe after news breathing or whatever else I'm listening to and taking some of that London morning breeze. I arrived into the office a bit earlier today because we have a pipeline meeting at nine. These meetings happen once a week within our whole team where we sit down and share what projects everyone is working on and if there's any interesting work or clients that we are trying to win over. To incentivize people to come in at nine, we usually have some pastries for those meetings. As one of the most junior person in the team, today is my duty to help buy the pastries. Of course, I can expense the cost later. I've recently finished a project and today I'm kicking off another piece of work for two senior managers. Consulting is a job that is project based, which means that you're not guaranteed to start another project right after you finish a first project. Between projects, we often help out with smaller pieces of work and that is the case today. I have a meeting with my senior managers at 10 today where they will brief me about the work that I will be doing for this coming week. Today is a bit more of a chill day because I'm not actually on a project. So when we're not on projects, we do a few things. And one of them is business development. So essentially you're doing different work for your team, which are not directly bringing in money. So that could mean you're writing a thought pieces for the team. That could also mean that you're helping up with a pitch that your team will bring to a client to sell them work. I'm not completely sure what I'll be working on today, but it seems like we're building a model of some sort. Uh, which should be quite fun. After the meeting, it seems like I'll be helping make an internal presentation that we will show our senior team. I'm helping out on crunching some Excel analysis, but to do that, we first need some data to work with. Turns out the data is not available yet, so while we wait, I decided to just do some general research about the topic that we will be covering in the presentation. Part of what I really like about the job is that through doing projects, you develop not just skills, but also knowledge and commercial awareness of what's happening around you. Sometimes it feels crazy how I'm being paid to learn about these things. But you know what's more crazy? That 90% of you watching still aren't subscribed to the channel. Scroll down now and spend two seconds clicking that subscribe and like button to follow along on my journey. <laughs> Weather's great today, so me and my friend decided to sit outside for lunch. I usually meal prep if I remember or have the extra time to do so. If not, then our canteen also have discounted food every day that we can buy. I personally prefer meal prepping because they are healthier, portions are bigger, and to be honest, I think the food that I cook are often better than what they have to offer in the canteen. Turns out there's also pizza today, but I didn't know, so I only had one slice. Although not super often, we sometimes do have team lunches and pizzas too. After lunch at 1.30, I have another meeting with my senior manager to discuss how we want to structure our slides. It gives us a clearer direction on what and how to do our analysis. Making slides is a big part of my job. Other than the content of what you are presenting, the ways in which you present them is also really important, which is why we pay so much emphasis on making pretty slides that look convincing. After that, I have another quick call with the research team because they are helping us pull the data we need for our Excel analysis. Yeah. After a few hours of work, me and my friends decided to go grab a cup of coffee and take a short break. I usually hang out with people who join the firm with me at the same time. We have the most similar experiences and we all sort of act as each other's support network. Although we are all the same grade, all of us are always on different projects. It's super cool to hear about what everyone else is doing and you always learn more about different industries. If not, at least you hear some exciting gossip within the office. After coffee, the research team have finally handed us the data I can use to run some calculations and analysis. This is another bulk part of my job as an associate. I spend a lot of my time cleaning messy data into more structured manner, which we can then do analysis on. Once I've done that, we can use different Excel formulas to run some calculations and plot graphs, which will then be used in our slides to draw out different insights. And today I wrapped up at around six. If I'm on a project, I'll usually finish a bit later, but because I'm just helping up with some internal work, it is usually more chill as the timeline isn't as tight. Let's go meet my friend.
I'm meeting some old friends for dinner and drinks today, one of them I haven't seen in about a year. Living in a big city can be lonely sometimes. Weird enough, the more people around you, the more lonely I feel sometimes. It is also really hard to keep in touch and make an effort to see all your friends when we are no longer in school. So nowadays I try to make an effort to meet up with some friends at least once a week and take the initiative myself whenever possible. This is where I wrap up my day. I spent two minutes journaling about what went well, what didn't and what I learned today. And this is a day in my life as a strategy consultant. If you did enjoy it, please give it a like or subscribe to the channel and follow along the journey. And with that being said, I'll see you again very soon.